to this episode of Grab and Go. In a recent case, a company sought an interim interim injunction against its former CFO, alleging his employment with a competitor would violate the non-compete covenant in his employment agreement with the company. And there was a risk that he would leak confidential information obtained during his employment. However, the court robustly refused to grant the injunction based on several factors. Firstly, the court found that the covenant did not have any geographical limitation and the company has failed to justify a worldwide restriction where the former CFO's role was limited to the Asia region. Second, the company failed to provide sufficient evidence to justify the 12-month duration of the non-compete covenant. The company's description of the confidential information which the former CFO has access to was lacking specificity. With a clear understanding of the significance of such information, the court was unconvinced that the lengthy restraint was reasonable. The fact that there was an explicit confidentiality clause in the former CFO's employment contract also diminished the need for the non-compete covenant. Lastly, the court noted that the non-compete covenant lacked the temporal backstop, as it applied to all work performed by the former CFO during his five-year employment. This overly broad scope rendered the covenant unreasonable. This case underscores the importance for employers to give careful thoughts when drafting restrictive covenants. The scope of such covenants must be reasonable and no more than necessary to protect the employer's legitimate business interests.